Um, you know, the scientific method says that, that you're supposed to be able to re repeat a phenomenon. Um, you know, it's, it's called repeatability, uh, or, uh, you know, you're supposed to be able to verify it through the experimental method. Well, if that's so, why can't you actually build a structure that will undergo this, this phenomenon? So, uh, so like, um, I, maybe you could build a house of cards so you could disturb it at the top and it would, it would kind of crumble from the top down. But, um, but, but here's, the, here's my challenge. Build a structure that, will, um, that has the same aspect ratio as the, as the tower, seven times as high as it is wide. If you disturb it from the top, um, it will, it will you know, progressively destroy itself and, and just, you know, the destruction will go to the ground. But here's the, here's the hard part. It also has to withstand a 100 mile an hour crosswind. So it has to, it has to, it has to survive a 100 mile of crosswind, and then you can take a torch or an axe or something, disturb it at the top, and it will just crumble from the top down. And if you can't do that, then how can you believe this, this theory? I mean, if you can't even build a structure that will do that, then how did the architects of the World Trade Center build, build a structure that did that when they weren't even trying?